Toastmasters guest, especially Eva. It's hard to evaluate someone who has a lot of experience by just showing up and her presence itself fills the room. I appreciate that about your deli the delivery style that you have. You are so confident, it's really hard to pick on something. But I did find something. <laughs> you excel at your, at your body language, the tone of your voice, the volume, and the variety of words that you use. You have a very rich vocabulary. And I learned every time you come up here and how you express yourself so clearly that we can understand perfectly every word you say, unlike me, because it's my second language. Guys, be patient. <laughs> but but it, it's something that I strive for. So I really like the way that you project yourself and, and deliver the message. Even that it's a topic that you express, it was very difficult because you didn't really have a formal mentor and you had your mentors and you gave us very good examples about your guests, pages, and lands, how they have helped you throughout your career, officially or unofficially. Um, knowing that you really didn't have a mentor in Toastmasters, because I know that, I think you have done an excellent job of being one of the best leaders in, in the Toastmasters club. And I love how you introduce how you want to run the program of those masters mentoring next year, next, <laughs> next, <laughs> yeah, next period, um, and that your passion is on growing the people's skills, develop them, and, and encourage them, and being a support. Great eye contact now for the things that to improve. I felt that it was a little bit rushed at some point. And I also, I know that you have great confidence and you came over here, I think you could be a little bit more interactive with the audience. Other than that, it's really hard to pick on something. Great job. <laughs> Thank you.